Hey everyone, Robert here. It's May 7, 2020, and I want to show you how to download photo albums that you have set up on Facebook. Now, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to navigate to your photo section, and this works if you have your album set up. So what we want to do is go ahead and left-click once on albums, and we are going to go ahead and download the cover photos as I have already downloaded a few of them. So let's go ahead and click on cover photos. And what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and click on the little gear icon and you're going to left click once on download album. Now what it's going to do is it's going to give you this dialog box saying that it's going to put everything in a zip file. That's basically a file that all the photos are sort of packed into one thing and it'll allow you for easy download. Now depending upon the amount of photos that you have in your album it may take a very short time or it may take a very long time. As for packing can, you know, take up some processing power on their end. But once it is ready, you are going to get a notification uh, in your notification section saying that the file is ready to download. Now, you can go ahead and do all the other things that you want to do on Facebook and it will run in the background. And once it is ready, notification will be there. And if it's your first time doing this, you may be prompted to enter your Facebook password the first time. But once you do that the first time, you won't be asked that again. So I'm going to go ahead and snip past this part or the part coming up where they're archiving and we'll go ahead and show you what it looks like once it's done. Now, in doing this, I had a little bit of problems downloading folders consecutively. Um, what I mean is that once I went and downloaded one folder and I tried to do the other one and download it, uh, the Facebook side of things got in a little bit of a hink and wouldn't allow me to do that. So I had to close out my browser and reopen it again and then go back up to my notifications to download the archived folder that Facebook had set up. But I was able to do that. It's not anything on our end, it's on Facebook side. And I also had to re-enter my password password before. Now, a special note, I am on what's called Facebook Classic. They do have a new version. If you go into the upper right hand corner on the drop down menu, and this only shows up on computers, if you switch to the new Facebook, you are not going to be able to see this option to be able to download your folders. At the very least, they haven't got this set up as of yet because I can go to my folders on my profile and if I switch to album view um, and go ahead and click on a particular album you are not going to be able to see the option in your little gear icon you're not going to be able to see your option on the edit album you're not going to be able to see anything from any of this stuff so you have to be on the Facebook classic and folks, I would suggest that you download your album should you want to now while Facebook Classic is still an option because eventually they are going to start phasing, well, at least in my opinion, Facebook Classic out and go to this new look. And who knows, they may have the option available later. Maybe this is a beta test. But in any case, this is uh, for those of you who want to download your albums onto your desktop, and as a final note, I would suggest that you do this because if you do something that goes against Facebook policies, and um, we all know the shifting sands of social media policies, and your account gets uh, frozen or even deleted, you have lost everything that you have uploaded. And it's good to have an archive of all this stuff if you haven't already saved it. Okay, that's it.